Uh, hi guys, um, this is the first video of my new channel and um, I found a pretty decent screen recorder that's going to help me do these um, videos and tutorials and guides and etc. Um, if my voice is a bit low quality, uh, my apologies, I'm using a rock band mic. Um, it's better than the built-in mic on my laptop, so uh, yeah, that'll have to do for now. Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up and install Fofix which uh, if you're watching this video you probably already know what it is but um, if you don't it's basically an open source rhythm game for your PC there's like a, a wealth of songs that you can download for it um, including songs from the rock band and guitar hero franchise and so uh, I'm going to show you how to set this up right now um, I expect it to go over several um, parts but uh, we'll see how it goes right uh, to get the program you just type in fofix oh fix on um, Google. Then you go to this first link here, it's hosted on uh, Google Code. Then show all. Then if you're on Windows, you click this link right here. Um, it says 32-bit, but it also works on 64-bit uh, operating systems. I'm on Windows 7, uh, Home Premium, 64-bit, and it works fine for me. Uh, apparently, it also works on Linux and Mac operating systems. Um, I haven't had any experience with those. Too, so I can't really help you out on that but um, yeah, if you have any questions regarding the windows I can help you out um, once you've done that, once you've downloaded it, you just install it, it's pretty easy for uh, most people to do, you can be able to handle that um, when you've done it, you will get a folder in my documents called Fofix now, the inside it is going to be all the game files uh, in this is what you click to load the game and inside here is where all the songs and everything are going to be stored in the data folder. Now, if you run Fofix now, you're not going to get anything. Um, well, it's basically an empty shell. There's no songs, there's no options. Well, there's options, but there's no songs, there's no themes, there's no nothing. So, you're going to want to get songs for it. So, what you do for that is you go to uh, Google again. Then you type in Frets on Fire Song Database. Now you click this first link here. Now you're going to need to sign up for the forums to download these songs, but it's free and it's like takes five minutes, or not even five minutes. So yeah, there's two ways of getting songs. Uh, one way is to visit the forums themselves, and the other way is to do it via this method on the database. So I'll show you the database way first, and I'll show you the other way next. Um, so say you want a song by ACDC, you click A. Um, let it load. Then you find ACDC. Here we go. Um, for example, let's go. Uh, let's pick. What should we pick? Let's pick just classic Back in Black. Right. And, and here it's got the difficulties: amazing, medium, and easy. But um, I don't think many people chart for easy because not many people play on that difficulty. But uh, yeah, it's normally expert guitar charts, that's what you'll see. So you click on the link here, then you just uh, you log in or you sign up. And uh, yeah, here you've got the file. So you click on this link, and you wait for it to load. Uh, and you, down you, do you download it, and however it might be. So for example, you save it, OK. Um, I'm going to save it in my Fofix file folder. Uh, Fofix songs and save it. Just wait for it to download. Um, and while it's downloading, I'm gonna I might have to pause the video here just uh, to wait for it to download. I'm gonna pause the video and uh, once that's done, I'm gonna play it again. Uh, okay, guys, right now it's downloaded and as you can see, the folder is there. It will come in a raw archive. So what you're gonna do? You're gonna click on it. And uh, there's this. And inside, you'll see all the files, all the game files. You can just click on this, extract to, and extract it into the same file. And here it is. Now, you click on it here, and here's the song files again. They contain all the information, the song name, and all that. And here's the here's the the actual the actual song itself. And here are the notes for the chart. So what you want to do? You want to right click, copy. Now you want to go to your Fofix folder here in my documents. Then you click data 
and then you might see a songs folder if you don't you can just create it just create a folder called songs nothing nothing too difficult then you paste you want to paste the the folder you just done in here so you can see back in black now that's back in black that is your first song that has been added to photoflix that would work now that's probably just expert guitar but uh, yeah you can get songs that will have drums and all that sort of stuff so yeah that's that's your first song been added the other way to get songs is just by going into the tune posting forum and you can see a bunch of songs here that people have posted um, for example someone's made Guitar Hero ACDC uh, basically and songs from uh, you know all sorts of different songs uh, Avenged Sevenfold here um, and, and threads up full of songs that people have made just click on any one of them and it's the same process just, I, I usually use this way, I don't use the song database, I just use the forums I find it a lot easier um, now um, when you launch it, launch the game, you'll be able to play the song but the, it, in my opinion it doesn't look very nice, the theme is not very attractive and um, so what I did, I made my uh, game look like Rock Band to make it look a bit more familiar, a bit better looking um, I'm going to show you what mine looks like and I'll show you how to get that when it loads, ok right, as you can see it looks like Rock Band um, it plays the Rock Band songs in the background although they're not actually part of the game unless you've downloaded it but uh, yeah, it looks exactly like Rock Band, the game as you'd expect. And I'm going to show you how to get that now. What you want to do to get the theme, you type in on, on uh, Google, Fofix Rock Band 2 theme. That's what you want. Then the first link, the first link here. And you'll still have to sign up to the forums. You click the first link, wait for it to load. Then you'll see music game themes. Now here's up to you. you can click, there's themes that make the game look like Lego Rock Band, Green Day Rock Band, Beatles and Rock Band 2, Rock Band 1, and even like Guitar Hero 1, the 80s and all that sort of stuff. Uh, say for example you want to make it look like Rock Band 2, click this link here and uh, wait for it to load. Someone's made a quite a nice, nicely laid out post here. Uh, this Rock Band 2 Lite, it's a light version of the theme, contains full theme, menu music, but not all stages. And this contains everything, and this contains just ultra light, because it contains the full theme, no menu music or anything like that and you click the respective thing you want to download once you've done that it's the same process as um, songs you just extract it and put it into the where is it here themes folder you just extract, put it in the themes folder same as you would do with the song but you put it in the themes folder and inside will be all of the all of the theme f files now what you need to do after that you need to set the theme you need to set the theme up so it's what is being used so to do that you go to the options oh sorry you need to go to the options in Fofix go to display settings and select the theme here to whatever the theme is called um, the default I think is Megalite or something like that but yeah you select it just press enter then keep backing out and and then that that will be it that's all that's required when it boots up again it will have the theme that you selected uh, and that's about it. You do the same thing for getting songs again. Uh, have whatever song you want, whatever theme you want, and uh, that's it. That's it for this part. Um, stay tuned for the next part when I show you how to set up your Guitar Hero guitar, rock band drums, and all that sort of stuff with the game. Thanks for watching, guys.